Exactly 37 years ago yesterday, everyone was left wondering who shot JR, a jaw dropping cliffhanger of an iconic TV show that captivated the country and the world. Now, two Ewings returned to Dallas to reminisce about the pop culture phenomenon and their time here in North Texas. Linda Gray and Patrick Duffy back in their old stomping grounds. A retrospective of Dallas. I mean, is there anything on the planet that hasn't been investigated about this show? <laughs> Taking center stage at the Winspear Thursday night to take the audience back to South Fork and the larger than life characters who called it home. It's because it goes deeper than just information. It, it, it satisfies something in people's psyche. I don't want anything from you, JR. Gray says at the beginning, Sue Ellen, JR's tortured alcoholic wife, had few lines of dialogue. She didn't even have a name, so she got to work to find her voice, studying the real life women of Dallas. They were Marcus. <laughs> <laughs> of course, that's where we went. And um, so I would just hang out there. She remembers a dinner at the mansion on Turtle Creek and the contents of a woman's tiny purse. Is that a gun? And she just looked at me very calmly and she said, Of course, this is Texas. They were forced to write Sue Ellen to the level that she became, which is, you know, absolutely the main character of the show. As for the moral Bobby Ewing, one half of a great sibling rivalry, Duffy says it almost wasn't. My character was supposed to die. That's how much she was supposed to be like Romeo. The stars seem to have a line for an iconic show that at the core was about relationships on and off screen. Where we're literally trying to rip each other's throats out. And then they yell cut and we go, oh, this is so yes, I can mean it. Where are we going for lunch? You know, it's that that's kind of true. thing. And that's, I, I think that's why the show stayed on the air. And that chemistry certainly showed there. A mm. Dallas retrospective starts at 8 p.m. tomorrow at the Winspear Opera House. Tickets start at $29.